I consult dozens of trucking companies in a month and it boggles my mind how they're just stuck in the mud when looking for truck drivers. And here's why. Most of them are offering same CPM, similar kind of home time, probably similar lanes, have similar kind of online and offline presence, and no way to differentiate themselves from other trucking businesses. And that's the reason why they can't find enough truck drivers. Now, most trucking companies, when I talk to them, they're just stuck in their ways. They're stuck in like 80s and 90s on how they approach to find truck drivers. Thinking of that also makes me think of a quote that Charlie Munger said, if you don't know who Charlie Munger is, he said, I don't regret all the money that I could have made or things that I would have gotten, but what I do regret is I did not wise up faster. So, you know, and that's the same thing for your, for your trucking business. If you're a fleet owner who's watching this is like, you know, being open-minded towards fixing the issue in your business is the biggest and most important thing. Most trucking companies or most trucking businesses, they're just hold it up and they're just stuck in boasting about they have late equipment and that's what they're investing in and my truck is the best thing and we offer the biggest CPM and every driver should come work for us. Guess what? Every trucking company is doing the same thing. How do you stick out from that crowd? Because everybody's thinking the same way. So you have to find a different way, a different approach on how to approach this. And not only that, learning from somebody who understands your hiring regions, your nuances that come with your business, what kind of driver you're looking for, because a flatbed driver is totally different than finding a drive-in driver. A driver in Northeast of US, where there's so much traffic, busy lanes, to worse as being in Midwest or Southeast where the roads are so open and wide is gonna be totally different, right? And the amount of work that they have to put in to deliver loads, pick up loads, it's gonna be totally different. So being that open-minded person to thinking, to think like how and why, um, what challenges I'm gonna run into to find drivers is the important task. And that's why you see a lot of trucking companies have gone out of business at an alarming rate, like 2019 was a devastating year for so many trucking companies, they went out of business because they couldn't find drivers. They just weren't being able to keep their truck seated. I speak to hundreds of trucking businesses and I see so many of them just stuck in their ways and this is how we do things, this is how we recruit drivers. They're just stuck in their 90s and 2000s of like the traditional approach. Yes, it worked in that era, but not anymore. The modern driver is seeking information in a different way, is looking for different things and so on and so forth. Where you have to come in places being that open-minded and coachable trucking business, looking for better ways to find drivers and actually learning from somebody who's done it 100 times over and understands your business too. So if you like this video, make sure you like, comment, subscribe, and hit that notification bell because I put out a lot of free content on how to find great qualified drivers for your trucking business and actually how to grow your trucking business. So a lot of cool stuff that I give away and you only get it when you hit that notification bell. This is Amrit signing off and I will see you in the next video.